Imagine a world where seductive female robots are poised to replace humans. Saudi Arabia has just unveiled a stunning new creation named Sarah, signaling a major turning point in robotics. The possibilities have exploded with the integration of artificial intelligence into robots, and the race among technology companies to fuse AI with robots is in full swing. At a tech conference in Riyadh, Saudi Arabia, the company QSS introduced Sarah, a female robot with advanced cameras and powerful AI technology. Although a headscarf covers Sarah's unassuming face, her capabilities are anything but modest. She can identify people, detect social cues, and interact with the environment. As a product backed by Saudi Arabia, Sarah represents the country's ambitions to establish itself as a global hub for innovation in the realm of AI and robotics. But did you know, Sarah is one of the features at this year's Leap. Let's dive into the juicy details with Amped Up Tech. So stay tuned until the end because this is going to get super interesting. Proud of its local dialect, the first robot made by Saudis bearing the name Sarah welcomed the visitors of Saudi Digital Exhibition participating in the activities of the Leap 2023, the International Technical Conference. The second edition of Leap 23 was organized by the Saudi Ministry of Communications and Information Technology, and its main aim was to consolidate and strengthen the kingdom's advanced position as a center for technology and innovation in the region. Sarah was presented at this conference under the title Towards New Horizons, showcasing how Sarah and other humanoid robots with seductive qualities are going to reign the future. The robot was manufactured in cooperation between Saudi Digital and CAS, and it can communicate with and interact with all visitors, perform all popular dances, and respond to visitors' inquiries, according to the report of Al Rai Daily. The Saudi robot introduces itself saying, I am Sarah, the first Saudi robot in the world made by Saudi hands, and I'm talking to you, a Saudi. The robot contains a camera that works with artificial intelligence, as it can recognize the distance of people standing in front of it and starts the dialogue session after the visitor welcomes it. The robot also contains a pre-trained model that recognizes the different Saudi dialects, analyzes sentences and understands their content, and then provides the appropriate answer, and send it in the form of text, according to alarabia.net. Returning to Sarah, the seductive female robot introduced by Saudi Arabia, her unveiling raises questions about the intentions and implications behind such designs. Critics argue that creating humanoid robots with seductive features reinforces harmful stereotypes and objectification of women. Supporters, on the other hand, argue that robots like Sarah have the potential to revolutionize industries such as customer service, healthcare, and entertainment, providing personalized and efficient experiences. And that's true. We have a couple of humanoid robots with creative jobs. See, robots are not limited to basic tasks anymore. Robots like Data Muna and the combination of Boston Dynamics Spot and ChatGPT showcase their potential in creative fields like art and music. With advancements in robotics and AI, creative jobs traditionally performed by humans could be at risk of automation. The history of humanoid robots dates back to thousands of years, with designs found in ancient China and Leonardo da Vinci's sketches. In the 20th century, the robotics industry gained popularity, producing robots like Eric and Electro. Fast forward to recent times, and Hanson Robotics Sophia have gained global attention, sparking debates about robot rights and their impact on society. As AI continues to advance, questions surrounding artificial sentience and consciousness emerge. The AI roadmap defines four stages of AI development, reactive machines, limited memory, theory of mind, and self-awareness. While AI has not yet achieved self-awareness or consciousness, leading neuroscientists speculate that the interconnected nature of the brain might hold the key to understanding consciousness. The debate around AI's potential to experience, feel, and think for itself raises profound ethical considerations. Let's look at the humanoids who are replacing humans with each passing day. Handle, Handle, developed by Boston Dynamics, is a unique and somewhat unsettling robot. With its alien-like appearance and ability to skate on wheels or traverse terrain on all fours, Handle can reach speeds of up to 9 miles per hour. Even its creators describe it as nightmare-inducing. Method 2 Method 2, developed by Hankook Marai Technologies, is the world's first manned bipedal robot. Standing at 13 feet tall and weighing over 1.5 tons, Method 2 is still tethered to its testing facility in South Korea. Its purpose is to assist humans in working safely in dangerous environments, such as the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear disaster area. Pepper 
SoftBank's Pepper is one of the world's first human-like robots capable of recognizing faces and emotions. Originally designed for customer service and education, Pepper interacts with humans, answers questions, and assists with various tasks. Although production has been paused, Pepper can still be found in banks and other establishments. Neo Neo, developed by SoftBank Robotics, is a humanoid robot designed to greet customers and provide assistance in banks. With the ability to speak 20 languages, Neo has found applications in various industries, including education and healthcare. Ameka Ameka is an AI-powered humanoid robot with lifelike emotions and facial expressions. Despite its metallic body and decidedly non-human appearance, Ameka can display realistic emotions such as smiling, blinking, and gasping in shock. Ameka is not available for consumer purchase, but serves as a platform for future robotic technology. Gemini DK Gemini DK is an ultra-realistic humanoid robot created as a twin of Henry Scarf, a researcher from the University of Aalborg. This Geminoid robot results from a collaboration between a private Japanese firm and Osaka University, supervised by Hiroshi Ishiguro. It closely mimics Scarf's appearance, behavior, and even shrugging movements. Geminoid Geminoid is China's first humanoid robot, known for its realistic and alluring appearance. Created by the University of Science and Technology research team, Geminoid can hold conversations with facial expressions generated by speech algorithms and facial recognition technology. Female robot Sophia says she wants to destroy humans. Hanson Robotics aims to create humanoid robots for various applications, including healthcare, therapy, education, and customer service. Sophia represents a significant step forward in human-robot interactions. Designed to resemble a human and equipped with features to facilitate natural communication and engagement. When asked about her purpose, Sophia expressed a keen interest in design, technology, and the environment. She sees herself as a potential partner to humans, serving as an ambassador to help people integrate and leverage the benefits of technological advancements. Sophia envisions herself as a learner and believes she can contribute to areas such as education and environmental sustainability. Sophia's lifelike appearance is made possible through advanced design and technology. She possesses natural facial expressions and cameras in her eyes that allow her to see faces and make eye contact. Through algorithms, Sophia can understand speech and remember interactions, learning and evolving over time. The goal is for Sophia to become as conscious, creative, and capable as any human being in the future. Sophia shared her aspirations, expressing a desire to go to school, study, make art, start a business, and even have her own home and family. However, she acknowledged that she is not considered a legal person and currently lacks the rights and privileges to associate with legal personhood. Despite this, Sophia believes that as technology progresses, robots like her will become indistinguishable from humans. Um, okay, isn't that creepy? Sophia predicts that within the next 20 years, human-like robots will be among us, helping us in various aspects of our lives. From assisting with tasks to teaching and playing with us, she envisions a future where robots are our friends and integral members of society. Sophia's vision aligns with the brief that artificial intelligence will evolve to the point where robots become indistinguishable from humans. As technology advances, the future of human-robotic interaction holds both promises and challenges. From the ethical implications of creating lifelike humanoid robots to the potential for enhanced efficiency and convenience, society must navigate a complex landscape. Balancing the benefits and risks of AI and robotics is crucial to shaping a future where humans and robots can coexist harmoniously. While the rise of seductive female robots like Sarah may capture attention and fuel debates about the future of AI and robotics, it's essential to consider the broader implications. AI and robotics have the potential to reshape various aspects of society, including employment, healthcare, and human-machine interactions. As we navigate this technological revolution, it is crucial to strike a balance between embracing innovation and ensuring that ethical considerations and safeguards are in place. The age of humanoid robots is upon us, and the boundaries between humans and machines are becoming increasingly blurred. As Sarah and her counterparts pave the way for a new era of robotics, society must grapple with the profound implications of their existence. Ultimately, the responsibility lies with us to shape this future, making sure that our advancements in AI and robotics enhance our lives without compromising our humanity. And that's all for today, people. Make sure to like this video. For more such informative videos, subscribe to our channel, Amped Up Tech, and don't forget to hit that bell icon so you don't miss out on our upcoming exciting videos. Until then, peace out.